Welcome to a new video of the parts channel. Well, you have asked me to talk about failure P0191. Well, that failure in the diagnostic machine refers to the ramp pressure sensor, like this one. That I have there in my hand, well, sensor operating problems, limit values, okay. Which can be high values or low values, let's see the main problems that the vehicle is going to give us. Well, since it is difficult for the engine to turn on, start, until it starts engine failure. In the frame and there is of course, you have to be careful because the vehicle can come to a stop. While running, okay, then you can go, well, because the vehicle is jerking and well, when. Accelerating it does not respond to the vehicle as it should and this is because the AQ is detecting that the. Pressure values that this part is giving it are incorrect, okay, that's why that fault appears. The first thing that is done when this fault appears, is to check the part, the first thing it would be to try. To clean it. Of course, look, it is L there you see a hole, there it detects the fuel pressure. It has a membrane at the bottom and they also have, most of them have a filter so. That they do not get impurities that are in the diesel or gasoline itself, but sometimes, well, well, the. Impurities stay there, sometimes it can be cleaned with a contact cleaner, sometimes it is cleaned and. Solved, but other times it is not solved and you have to change it, okay, here you have the connector. Two. This should also be checked, because sometimes it is also due to dirt on the connector itself or it can also be a problem with the wiring, okay, then you have to see if the failure is also accompanied by other failures, if it can be a P1200, a P0200 and others and there would be. You have to look at other things, okay, because sometimes it can also be a problem with the pressure regulator valve, which is not working well and sometimes the AQ can blame this part, but. That is usually in older vehicles, in vehicles more modern when or there is a fault in this part, it is that the problem usually comes from here, which could be the part or the wiring, in older vehicles this P0191 can appear alone and it turns out that it does not reach enough pressure to the rail, okay, it does not arrive enough pressure, because because it may be a pump problem, that it does not detect it, as I say, or it may even be the clogged filter, even the gauge pump, the fuel tank pump, which does not send enough pressure, okay, that's where you have to look a little more, but in more modern vehicles, I have already said that it discriminates very well if the fault comes from here or if it in turn gives this fault, but also, when the AQ doubts, it can get more faults, because the AQ it can detect, it says, this part, the pressure sensor, does not give me the correct pressure, but I have an injector that can be, well, 1, 2, 3, or 4, it also depends on the vehicle. Whatever, that I detect is bind. Open, then it already gives more information and we would have to. Look more as things, okay, but mainly when that fault comes up, in most cases. The problem usually comes, as I say about this piece, I also say that it depends on the age. Of the vehicles, so that the information of the AQ is more or less exact, okay, well here is. This video, if it has been useful to you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel.